just made this cake yesterday and see how much of it's already gone? Yeah, that's crazy. Make sure your cake is cooled completely before you try and take it out of the pan. I've had many a cakes just completely fall apart on me because I tried to take them out of the pan before they were completely cool. So make sure they are on a cooling rack. They're gonna stay there for at least 30 minutes. Parchment paper is your best friend. Make sure when you're making a layer cake, you're gonna make the outline of the sheet pan. If you don't have parchment paper, just spray that bad boy with cooking oil, put in a little bit of flour, tap out the excess. Uh, yeah, I had so many times where the cake didn't come out of the pan and it was a disaster. Make sure your cake is completely cooled before you ice it. It will be runny and all over the place. Your icing will not stick to your cake and it will be a hot mess. If you're doing multiple layers on the layer cake, do each layer one at a time in the oven. Halfway through the cooking process, flip it, rotate it about 90 degrees. You'll thank me on this one later. That's how to avoid some of the most common baking disasters. Make sure you leave me a comment below and I will be sure to help you with all of your baking disasters because nobody wants that. They just want to eat some cake, right? Mm -hmm.